this is probably gonna be my last e39 video but i got a guy coming in a couple days to buy both of these and i realized so i talked to him earlier today about giving him directions to get here it's like oh i never talked about the abs modules and the troubles you have with those so that's what we're gonna do right now okay e39 This is the anti-lock brake module, our system, and it has electronic control on this side. Right here is the exhaust. Yes, they have a heat shield, but there are some contacts inside there, inside the electronic part, that over time react poorly to heat. My running E39, I was driving home somewhere, and actually from a far ways away, Hour into the drive, all of a sudden, boof, a bunch of things come on. Trash control, uh, what else came on? Trash control, brake light, and something else. The brake, the amber brake light, not the red one. And something else all came on. It's like, what the heck? Turns out, when the thing inside here heats up, I looked up online, found this out. It uh, loses contact, or makes contact. And it shuts down the ABS. Turn the car off. Let it sit for an hour. Fire it back up. We're good. For five minutes or an hour. It kind of depended. Mine, it was about... I had about 20 minutes. So what I did was I took... Oh, yeah. These are specific. This ABS module is VIN specific to this vehicle. Here's the VIN. This is an automatic 2.5 liter sedan. The one that was in this car I'm gonna get the hood open. Uh -oh. oh well. It opened a while ago. <laughs> Whatever. This is Module Master. Moscow, Idaho. What you do is you pull your module off of your car, ship it to them. This is actually the one off that car. And they sent you this fancy packaged and wrapped up thing. I got it back four days. Putting this off a of touring, automatic touring, 01. In my 03 manual touring, the ABS light was on all the time. My cruise control still worked, and everything else worked. I drove it for about a week with the wrong module in there, and they're easy to... There's a bunch of pins in there, but this thing pops out and just comes out. It's a very easy swap. There's six... Uh, two, yeah, six screws. Anyway, this is a common fault. Audi... VW, Jaguar, I don't know who all else used these things. A lot of people, Land Rover, a lot of people used the exact same module. Hopefully they weren't all foolish enough to put them next to the exhaust manifold, but I just wanted to do a video before these cars go away that there was a place in Boston or somewhere around Boston that went out of business and on the BMW forums, there was quite a few guys saying, can, you, can someone drive by there and you know, get my my module back. They just went out of business in the middle of the week. Caused all kinds of troubles. So if you have weird lights and you have this thing has to work for you bleed the brakes because on the scanner you have to activate this to get the brakes bled. It's really kind of a weird system. But it works very well when it works. So module master Moscow Idaho. This is is there a date on this thing? This has been a couple years. Ah, this was in June of 21. So four years, almost four years now. Uh, it's a simple fix. I don't remember the exact cost. It was not that exorbitant. And the thing worked great until I sold it last summer. But there, the Module Master is the one that worked for me. 